main area of the backline which United were keen on strengthening. This term, injuries to key defenders have hindered the team from nailing down a consistent run of results and performances. Diogo Dalit remains the only first-team defender not to have picked up a physical setback. With the future of the likes of Rafael Verani, Johnny Evans, Harry Maguire and Victor Lindelof far from secure, central defense has widely been tipped to be the main priority for United. However, according to Romano, the left-back role will also be addressed by the club.at the moment. Eric Ten Hag has no senior and fit left-back available for selection. Both Luke Shaw and Tyrell Malaysia are currently out with long-term injuries Shaw has missed large parts of the campaign and has been in and out of the treatment room. The Englishman has only managed 15 appearances across all competitions. Malaysia has yet to play even a single minute of action this term. The Dutchman got injured during pre-season and suffered an undisclosed setback during his recovery. Ten Hag recently expressed doubts about whether Malaysia will at all feature for United before the season draws to a close. Shaw is also very unlikely to play competitively before the campaign ends. Ten Hag will almost certainly have to see out the rest of the season with no natural left back. Lindelof has been mandated to occupy that position in the meantime. Sofian Amrabat can also play there but much like Lindelof, is not really effective. According to Romano, Manchester United have already planned months ago to bring in a new left back in the summer. Expected to be a young one, an important player. Shortlist to be decided once board structure will be completed but Manchester. United will go for LB, no matter what happens with Malaysia. The upcoming window is gradually shaping up to be a pivotal one in United's history, Rafael Verani, Casemiro's Everton display proving Ineo's summer TR. Bruno Fernandes stuns as Man United get back to winning ways in 2-0, match report. Manchester United 2-0 Everton, Man United News and T. Three things we learned as Manchester United ease past Everton in two, Manchester United 2-0 Everton, player ratings, Man United News and Eric Ten Hag Fabrizio Romanoluk Shotirel Malaysia. Derek Canotti is a football writer at the People's Person who has covered Manchester United and the game extensively for many years. He is a keen analyst with expertise in SEO and journalism standards. Derek is convinced Wayne Rooney is the true GOAT and won't hear otherwise. Fabrizio Romano has revealed that Manchester United's prospects of selling Case Moreau in a big-money summer deal remain alive. Having starred in his first season at Old Trafford, Case Miro has struggled to make a similar impression this time around. Although the Brazil international is under contract until 2026, Man United are expected to cut their losses and sell the 32-year-old in the summer should a suitable bid come in as Sir Jim Ratcliffe targets a new-look team for next term. Ronaldo was wrong. Saudi Pro League a massive flop as embarrassing TV figures revealed. Big European clubs are unlikely to be willing to spend big on a player who appears to be past his best, yet football transfer specialist Romano says that interest from the Saudi Pro League remains. For Case Miro at the moment talks are not advanced, but the interest from Saudi is still there, Romano confirmed on the daily briefing they were interested in the midfielder last summer, and then again around October-November some. Calls were made to intermediaries to understand the situation. It's important to mention that there was never a concrete proposal put to Manchester United. Let's see what will.